Inflation is not only pushing up the price at the pumps, but also your favorite small businesses. News 10's Neil Zerang shares how local restaurants are reacting to the sticker shock. Restaurants have to make a tough decision. As prices rise from their suppliers, do they pass the price on to the customer? <laughs> Smiles are on the faces and food is on the plates of customers at Headley Taste 2 in Lafayette. Owner Samantha Williams hopes it stays that way next week when she introduces a new menu with all the same items but more expensive prices. Everything is just going up and we have to go up around prices in order to survive. When she says everything is going up, she's not kidding. A gallon of grease used to be $21 a year ago. Now she's spending $49. A box of chicken tenders was $34. Now it's $65. And the prices extend to even packaging like to-go boxes, which have tripled. And many small restaurants work with the same suppliers. You don't want to tell the customers every time, well, this is why I'm going up because of this. But if you're going in stores right now, you see what I'm saying. I think it's affecting everything right now. Director Heidi Malasaw with the Louisiana Small Business Development Center in Lafayette has heard the same story across several industries and likens it to a tidal wave that ends with the customers. It's anything from a consumer oriented business, such as a restaurant retailer, to those that may be having problems. With supply chain issues and you know rising cost in construction and industrial projects as well, so it's affecting all business owners right now. Williams doesn't desire any small business to go down because prices are going up. She only made the change after her deli made no profit. I work at another restaurant, a large business, and they have a lot to lean back on. But a small business, we don't have a lot. I don't for sure have a lot to lean back on. So I work with what I have, but with prices going up right now, I'm trying to survive. That's all I can say is I'm trying to survive. It's hard because everything is just going up. We did speak to other restaurants off camera who all said the same things. Niels Rang, KLY News 10. Thanks, Neil. The Small Business Development Center added the true test to these new prices will come after the holidays when people typically cut back on eating out and spending money.